these are some B-roll shots that we took of um, a timber rattlesnake uh, in Mays County. I want to say these come from the fall of 2019, which we will forever remember as the last sane year on planet Earth. We caught this guy over by a set of rocks. We think there might kind of be a den site over there in that area. And um, he gave us some good shots. We're not going to complain. Uh, probably a little bit of the footage in today's video you may have seen before. Um, my apologies if you do see something that's redundant. But I just um, wasn't feeling up to editing a lot of stuff I had in the queue this week so hopefully this will this will work um, <laughs> and hopefully you guys enjoy this this guy was um, a little bit harder to film than most of the timbers I filmed Usually they kind of understand that they're not getting away and they'll kind of coil up on you. <clears throat> this guy didn't. He just kept trying to get away. And um, once again, I just want people to really see the elusive and reclusive nature of these snakes. I mean, sure, they have a dangerous bite. You want to take it seriously if you're bitten by one. But I don't know how people get bitten by these guys. Literally, they are so uh, non-aggressive. They so just want to go the other way and want nothing to do with us. I'm really, really fascinated by the timber rattlesnake for this reason. And they're just amazing snakes to see and amazing snakes to film. And this is footage of another timber rattlesnake from the same location, if memory serves me correct. One of these days I'm going to start labeling things better. Um, this guy was a little bit easier to film than that other one. He was just um, kind of more relaxed and just stood there and coiled up after we hooked him a few times. Um, once again, you know, no strikes, no bites. That does not mean you underestimate these guys by any means. They can pack a wallop if they do manage to bite you. But um, I've only had one or two strike at me the whole time I've been finding them and been herping. So, you know, keep it easy and watch out for these guys and you won't have problems from them. And I'm going to close this out with some other bee footage of a little young copperhead we found. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it wasn't one of my top productions, but stay tuned. We'll be back. You guys have a good weekend.